Hi everyone, this is Leslie from Midlife and Nailing It. If you could please hit the subscribe button and the notification bell, I'd really appreciate it. Today I have for you five favorite things from the month of December. I post one of these at the end of each month. I'm also announcing a giveaway uh, that will be towards the end of the video, so make sure you stick around. So today I have for you my five favorite things um, from the month of December. I did one of these last month for November and I plan on doing one each month. So with no further ado, here are my five favorite things from the month of December. Okay, so I thought it only fitting since we're going into January to talk about some of the items that I use to stay organized throughout the year. Uh, I've already done a video on my Erin Condren planner. I will put a link uh, to that video in my description box below in case you want to see a full flip through. Uh, but yeah, you want to make sure that you get yourself a planner, especially if you're a mama and you've got a lot going on with the kids. Maybe you work, whatever. Stay organized. This is a good way. I know that a lot of people use their phones and stuff, and if that works for you, great. But I find it a lot easier to be able to open up my page for the week and know what's going on. I can see it all at once. I'm a super visual person, so I enjoy a, paper, a planner, something that I can touch, that I can see that's super organized. Um, yeah, so my favorite planner is the Erin Condren planner. Um, I've obviously used lots of planners in my life, but I tried the Happy Planner last year. I prefer Erin Condren. I like the pages better, the paper's higher quality. Um, that's the biggest difference between the two. But like I said, I'm going to leave a link of the video about my Erin Condren planner in my description box below. So. My next item is uh, planner stickers, and I wanted to talk about where I get my a lot of my planner stickers from. Uh, I like to buy them from Etsy. They have a huge variety, and I really love supporting other women, so I highly recommend Etsy as a whole. Uh, I know there are men on there too, but there's a lot of mamas making some money while they're at home with their kids, and I love supporting that. That's another reason why I really like YouTube and supporting uh, moms on YouTube as well. Uh, but this is from Sticky Peonies, and they are one of my favorite companies. Look at how pretty those stickers are. I love stickers. I still love stickers even though I'm an adult, but um, yeah, I use these to decorate my planner. And then I also have like functional stickers here as well. I got this in a kit. And so all of her kits are similar, um, and this is another theme that I went with, as well as how cute is this one? This one's my favorite. But yeah, she is Sticky Peonies, and she's on Etsy, and I highly recommend her stickers, and as women, let's support other women. Etsy is awesome. Okay, so my next item that I love is also from another shop at Etsy. It's called Meyer Market Designs, and I bought this little tablet, and it was just a few bucks. It might have been on sale, but it really, I know it was under five dollars, and um, it's a meal planner, so I can go ahead and organize my meals and um, it's got a little ingredients list. Um, it's just super cute and very inexpensive. So once again, I got this from Meyer Market Designs and um, I will include a link to Meyer Market Designs in my description box as well. But I plan on using this tablet in my videos uh, because my what's for dinner videos seem to be pretty popular and I want to um, show how I organize. Uh, I have been using my phone for organization for meal planning uh, recently, but for my whole entire adult life, I've always just used pen and paper or a tablet uh, like this or something uh, to organize my meal planning. So I thought that this might be helpful in showing people how I stay organized with my meal planning for the year. So next up, I want to show you the most awesome grocery bags that I have found. Uh, I use these 
most I should use them all the time, but admittedly, I use them when I go to Aldi or I go to Trader Joe's. Um, I found these on Amazon. I will try to find them and put them in my description box below for you so you can find them if you want. I can't remember exactly what the price was, but I know they were super inexpensive. So look at how big these bags are. They're giant, guys. They really are, and they fit so much. And so, and the fabric is super heavy duty. They're very strong bags. I know sometimes grocery bags uh, that you can buy, just they fall right apart. Um, this is sort of, I think it's called canvas. Oh my gosh, I am totally brain dead. So, um, but it's like, uh, it's the same kind of material, like a rain jacket would be made out of or um, something like that. Uh, but yeah, you can fold them all up. You can get fancy if you want. There's a little pocket on the inside. You can fold the, them all up, and I keep them inside of uh, one of the bags when I go in, and then I just pull out what I need. So it came with five bags, and they all came together. I'll kind of quickly show you the patterns. And I, I want to say they had other, like, patterns to pick from. Um... Not individually, uh, you had to get them all at once, uh, but I love these grocery bags. They're my favorite ones I've ever owned, and I'll include a link to um, them uh, on Amazon in my description box below. I wanted to show you an unboxing real quick because this is one of my favorite things as well. I did a what's in my purse video, and in that video I talked about how much I love coach bags and how much I love thread up. It's the only place I buy handbags from. I went ahead and purchased another coach handbag from thread up. Uh, the savings that you get uh, when you purchase a name brand handbag from thread up is tremendous and you can uh, go ahead and use their filter system and you can click on like new or new with tags and every time I have not been disappointed in the quality of the handbag that I've gotten. So I am going to go ahead and include in my description box below the what's in my handbag video as well as a link to thread up. So let's go ahead and do this quick unboxing. I did pull them out of the bags. They always come, thread up items always come in the cute little polka dot tissue paper. I'm doing this with one hand. You guys know that's how I roll and it doesn't always go well. This is the coach bag that I got and it is a coach bag. This is not coach factory. Let me show you the inside is pink like a pink satin maybe and they've it's got some pockets in there for cell phones and keys and stuff um, but yeah it's a probably a me medium sized bag so super cute I love it and then you guys guess what let me open this because this is the really exciting part just like I mentioned in uh, the what's in my handbag video that I did when I want to just run to the store or something or I'm going to a concert or something where I just need my wallet and that's it it's a wristlet so you can just pull it out of your bag and run and go with it so i am so excited about my new coach purse and my wallet okay guys so i could keep this really awesome coach purse and wallet for myself and it's tempting it really is because this is so super cute but i'm going to go ahead and give it away uh, I am at 93 subscribers. When I reach 100 subscribers, I am going to announce a giveaway of this coach purse and this coach wallet. Um, I will let you know what the rules are when I reach 100. So make sure you hit that subscribe button because when I get to 100, this will be the giveaway. I'm kind of hoping I hit it today day because everyone's going to be so excited about this giveaway. I will see you soon.